Hello Pisces, welcome to your June 2023 Tarot Podcast, brought to you by me, Kathleen Robinson of Karma Queen's East Yorkshire Tarot and Five Tarot. And just before we get into your reading, if you'd like to have a one-to-one -one tarot card reading with me, then contact me by email at karmaqueens at gmail.com. So back to you. This month, Pisces, you've been brought the two of rods upright, and it's all about planning and putting things in motion. Because you're aware that in order to maximise on the opportunity presented to you right now, you must leave your familiar grounds. And it's about planning and progressing because you've been able to take your idea and turn it into a feasible plan that you know will lead to your success. It's no longer just an idea, but you've got a plan in place to make things happen. It can indicate that you may be entering a partnership as well of some sort, which is going to be highly beneficial. It's reminding us to stay mindful of the give and take also that's required for all successful relationships. Because if things are feeling out of balance for you, know that they're about to get really good. Keep your eyes on the prize that you're looking for metaphorically and remain or get positive. As far as work goes, you're about to fit things together in a new or unusual way. Work's about to get a lot smoother, and if you're looking for employment or up, you are about to find the right fit. Don't let anyone knock you off your stride. You're more together and balanced than you might realize work-wise now. As far as love goes, if you're already in a relationship, it's about to get a lot more equal. Pay attention to your ideas about equality and balance and share them. And if you're looking for love, someone who could be very good for you is already part of your life. Don't judge a book by its cover. If someone is interested in you, give them a chance. This relationship could be just what you're looking for. In terms of finances, your income and outgoing is mo moving towards a better state of balance. The two of rods indicates fairness and equality. Don't hesitate to ask for what you truly want and you feel that you're worth. You're likely to be pleasantly surprised by how much you can improve your financial situation. The rule with the two of rods is you're far better doubling up with somebody than going that pathway alone because you both together is much more than the sums of your separate parts, as they say. So that's all from me, Kathleen Robinson. Until the next time, take care.